video tutorial from computergargard.com. This tutorial will look at quickly performing calculations in Excel. Now there's tons of tutorials at computergargard.com about writing formulas and the variety of functions that are available in Excel. But for some simple calculations then formulas are not always necessary. In the spreadsheet I have at the moment, it's a fairly large spreadsheet lots of figures, lots of values uh, regarding orders that have been placed. If I want to be able to perform quick calculations on this, the first thing I'd want to do is down on the status bar near the bottom of your screen is to right click on that status bar. And we can see that the main functions in Excel, such as finding the average, counting, the maximum, the sum, these can be turned on or off in Excel 2007. In Excel 2003 you can change this by right clicking on the status bar but you can only show one at any given time. From 2007 I could maybe tick average here as well and when I select a bunch of numbers like so I can see the average, the count and the sum of them numbers at the bottom of my screen. Yeah, fantastic technique that allows you to quickly find a formula result without actually having to write a formula. Another good example of this in action, maybe I want to choose a category of product from my filter here. So I'll choose dairy products. That will filter the list to only show dairy. I could then select that column of dairy products. And once again, I've got the sum of the dairy at the bottom how many orders for dairy products and what is the average order amount for a dairy product. Once again, no need for writing a SUMIF function there or performing database functions or maybe using pivot tables or many of the other, the other techniques are available. Sometimes, unless you need that, always visible, just a quick, simple calculation there. Thank you for watching. Please check out some of our other tips and tutorials at computergargard.com.